Hi, this is Larry, and the topic now is what is an attribute in relational database design? So what is an attribute? Basically, an attribute is a characteristic associated with an entity. It's anything that describes or identifies an entity. An attribute is then, therefore, the logical definition, then, and is represented physically as a column in a DBMS. As an example, you can have an employee, and an employee will have the following uh, attributes. First name, last name, social security number, and probably have been assigned an employee ID. And same thing with the department. A department will have a department code, department name. It might even have information about what types of things it does and authorizations. So you can see these are two different entities, department and employee, and they have different attributes that are characteristics of them or describes or, or identifies the entity. So keep in mind that an attribute is a characteristic or property of an entity. And a big thing to remember is that it belongs to one and only one entity within a database. You only have to have that entity, uh, excuse me, attribute once in the database itself. And it should be associated with one entity. And each entity, each entity, therefore, must have at least one attribute. You cannot have an entity unless it has one attribute. Now, how do you go about discovering attributes? Well, identify the ad adjectives in business rules and requirements. Look for things that are described or identify. Okay? And then also obtain a list of items that need to be stored from users, existing reports, etc. What you're going to be surprised is that as you go about looking at different things and talking to people, whether it's in interviews or looking at them during their work, that people will talk in terms of adjectives. They don't talk in terms of entities. They'll talk about all the data that they need. I need this piece of information. Okay, what kind of information? What data do you need for that information? You need this, this, and this. Oh, I get it. Okay, so you have to go through, and when you talk to them, just ask them what they need, and you'll be surprised. They talk in attributes. They don't talk in entities. And as a programmer or a developer, you're definitely going to need to be able to go out and take all the attributes and then assemble them into being entities.